Hey, this is Henry from Fandom, and we are here at Comic-Con with George Newbern, the voice of Superman in the Injustice games, Injustice 2. So, what's it like being, you know, the superhero, the Superman? It's it's a bit of a responsibility, I'll be honest with you, but uh, it's a, it's been an honor and a, and, a, and a blast for the past, I don't know, 15 years or so. Yeah, been amazing. You know, after playing Superman for all that time, like, is it is it fun to kind of cut loose and be an evil Superman in, in Injustice? Oh, it, it, that being the evil side of, of, a, of a, an iconically good guy is a blast, um, and it's fun to always sort of find the, find the, um, push the envelope and find the, the edges of this guy because it's it's not easy. And what's it like to you know work against all the other the other superheroes in the game? Like, do you? I, I know a lot of the times you maybe don't record with them, but like, do you are you at least thinking like, oh, now he's talking to Batman, now he's talking to Wonder Woman? Like, do, do you think about those relationships with the characters? Uh, yeah, yeah, you do. You have to. Um, although in a game, it's a little different because you, they just do it on little bits, right? Little little chunks of moments. So um, there's not a lot of uh, not a lot of time for complicated uh, social. Uh, complicated relationship but dynamics so it's more like is this guy hitting me or is, is is he not hitting me or is he trying to blow me up or is he not trying to blow me up so you really do have to, in in uh, the games or animation or whatever you really do have to depend on the director to to paint a picture for you because you don't have all the information so you're just you're really just trying to focus on the moment right at hand whatever whatever's happening in that moment and what the director can sort of fill in for you you know superman has some crazy attacks in this game and in the previous injustice is there a particular favorite of yours not one specifically but i do always enjoy a good wind up and a follow through where he flies through the middle of a building that's always been a favorite of mine